Well, look what we have here. Behind the proverbial old barn in the country, another long lost Cheviac. Same year as my first one, same color, 1986. But this one's actually called a Chevy. It's got the Chevy grill on it, see? And it's all grown in, and it's been sitting for over a year. Awesome. So, oh, there is a little rust there in the usual spot. Original paint. Caprice. Yep. The only thing wrong is the peeling paint. Vinyl roof is perfect. And he was just going to scrap it. Yeah, he was going to scrap it. He was going to send it to the auto wreckers. He's nuts. I told him I could make it famous. Yes, you could. Yes. So let's check her out a little bit more. we got to see if we can get it running. Oh, this one's loaded. Yeah, I know, eh? Oh, wow. Only 160,000 kilometers. No wonder it's so good. Other than just a couple little bits of dirt, looks in perfect condition. Yep. Yeah, what a sweet car. The battery's not connected. Well, the battery's from last year, so there's no way it's going to start. No. I'll stick the key in just for fun, but yeah. I doubt anything's going to happen with no, an old battery. You never know. <laughs> maybe you got the secret touch, Dave. Oh, yeah, maybe we do. Who knows? No, there's not even a light on. I didn't expect anything. Well, I brought another battery. Okay, go get that battery. Okay. It's not clamped in down there, so we just got wingy dingy nuts. That's no problem. See, Mr. Helper, I brought you along for some reason. I know you did. And oh, it's got a four barrel, new air cleaner. Its fender wells aren't rusted out. No. A little bit of rust on the rad cradle. Got a big hole down here by the wheel well. Oh, that's just ventilation. That's redneck air conditioning. Oh, gotcha. That's okay. Little mouse nest forming. Let's see if the throttle is stuck. That's uh, a little stiff, but I think she'll work. So I'll get a little bit of primer gas too, so we can get a fast fire if the starter is good, because the old man told me there might be a problem with the starter. All right, show us your muscles. Oh, exactly the same battery. That's funky. Yeah, I know, it's weird. <laughs> the only problem is it doesn't have the other connector. Oh yeah, get this little cap off. Look, that ball went right down in there. Mm. <laughs> okay, we've primed her up with some gas dumped in the carb, and we're all ready to see if the starter's good and it's working. Are you recording? Yes. Okay, no idea. Saddle's a bit stiff. We have ignition. Okay. No, Nothing. Okay, I brought. Some, okay, shut camera off. I brought something for Plan B. Okay, I brought the enforcement officer with me. The enforcer. A solid bar to get down there and whack the starter motor. She can't get a hammer in there and see if that temporarily brings it back to life. Take two, a little beating, see what makes a difference. Nothing. So we may have to see if there's any power getting to the starter. Well, I just arced the starter motor with a screwdriver. It just made some sparks in the solenoid, so we're getting ready for day two when we come back and change the starter to get this pig running.